this is Kevin with the JL Audio Training Department, and I'm here with a two-minute tech tip. This two-minute tech tip is on the basic difference between Linkwitz Riley and Butterworth filters, what I feel are the most commonly used. To help show these differences, I'm going to actually switch over to Tune software. Tune is a free download, so you can go in and model these yourself. Let's get started. With Tune software and simulation mode, I selected a basic routing utilizing Tune setup tool to illustrate the Linkwitz Riley and Butterworth filters. In the bottom left of the Tune tab, you will see the crossover panel. Next to the word crossovers, you'll see an icon. I'm going to select this icon to pull up the filter response pane. I want to focus on comparing two response curves, so I'm going to deselect a few filters that were automatically set in place by the setup tool. Now, we are only looking at both left and right mid-base responses. On the graph, the frequency is at the bottom and amplitude measured in dB is on the left. You can see we are set up at 24 dB Linkwitz Riley high pass filter at 80 Hz. Notice how this filter interacts with the frequency response and how it attenuates. With Linkwitz Riley, the filter cutoff frequency of 80 Hz is 6 dB down. Since 80 Hz doesn't land exactly on a division on the graph, we will select 100 Hz for a better visual representation. Now we can clearly see that 6 dB down is at 100 Hz. Let's compare the different slopes of Linkwitz Riley filters. Let's select 12 dB Linkwitz Riley. Notice that the filter cutoff frequency remains the same 6 dB down, however, the slope starts earlier and is a more gradual rate of attenuation. Now let's select 48 dB Linkwitz Riley. Again, the cutoff frequency is still 6 dB down, however, it's a lot steeper slope. Now, by selecting the 24 dB Butterworth, we can compare it against the 24 dB Linkwitz Riley. And you can see the difference. As we said before, the Linkwitz Riley cutoff frequency is always 6 dB down. With the Butterworth filter, we can see that the filter cutoff frequency is actually 3 dB down. Now, let's look at the Butterworth slopes. Again, you will notice that the filter cutoff frequency is always 3 dB down, so the main difference between the two types of filters is Linkwitz Riley is always 6 dB down at the filter cutoff frequency, and Butterworth is always 3 dB down at the filter cutoff frequency. Now, there are a few other differences between the filter types, and we're strictly working with the electrical responses. So if you take acoustical measurements in a vehicle, you're probably going to see a little bit different response. However, the principles are the same. So that's your two minute tech tip. Hit the like button below, feel free to comment, and subscribe for more two minute tech tips.